Synhelion. A major event in the solar energy world went largely unnoticed on June 20th. Synhelion launched the first ever plant in Germany that uses solar heat to produce synthetic fuel on an industrial scale. The process is simple and efficient. Mirrors concentrate sunlight onto a receiver on a special tower. generating heat that's fed into a thermochemical reactor to produce fuel. Currently, the output is modest, just a few thousand liters per year. However, Synhelion is now scaling up the technology, so we may soon see the market flooded with solar fuel. Transformation. Transform is a stunning piece of tech art, shown for the first time at the Lexus Design Amazing Milan show back in 2014. Even today, it continues to captivate. Have you ever seen a table quite like this? It morphs based on the flow of data and energy, made from three dynamically shaped displays with over a thousand pins moving up and down. its movements aren't random. Instead, they're driven by the kinetic energy of viewers captured by sensors. The motion mimics the interplay of wind, water, and sand. Transform explores the clash between nature and machine, finding harmony in the tabletop's ever-shifting landscape. Tesla Cybercab and Robovan. Elon Musk has done it again. Apart from playing DSX and eating donor kebabs, he appeared on the show We Robot. Tesla gave us a sneak peek into the future of autonomous transportation with the Cybercab and the Robovan. First up is the Cybercab, a sleek two-door cab with no pedals or steering wheel. Instead, AI takes the driver's seat. Standout features include a massive cabin screen and butterfly doors reminiscent of supercars. Musk claims the Cybercab will cost less than $30,000 and will hit the market by 2027. Impressive, right? But let's also check out the Robovan. This self-driving vehicle is like a minibus that seats up to 20 people. It can transform into a mobile coffee shop, a workshop, or whatever else is needed. For now, though, it's just a mock-up to wow exhibition guests and spectators. So no price or release date for the Robovan just yet. E-Foldy Explorer. The E-Foldy Explorer scooter is now available for anyone willing to spend $3,520. For that price, you get a foldable and relatively light design, weighing just 17 kilograms without the battery. While it's another electric vehicle, it stands out because it's easy to take on public transport or fit in a car trunk. It even doubles as a chair. The E-Foldy isn't super fast, with a top speed of 13 kilometers per hour and a range of 23 kilometers on a full charge. According to the manufacturers, this is enough to give users a new sense of freedom. Plus, pneumatic tires and a four-point seat suspension ensure a comfortable ride. Perutu D7. Robots are now stocking shelves in store aisles and weaving between tables in restaurants. They're even taking over the role of elevator operators. This isn't a scene from a sci-fi novel, but a reality that's quickly approaching thanks to Pudu Robotics. The company plans to launch the Pudu D7 robot next year. This robot can lift up to 10 kilograms with each arm and does so with incredible precision.
down to 0.1 millimeters. Equipped with advanced AI, the Pudu D7 not only plans its actions efficiently, but also learns continuously. It can move at speeds of up to two meters per second and works for over eight hours on a single charge. Where do you think the Pudu D7 would be most useful? Binny. Recycling makes a real difference, especially when it comes to slowing down the growth of landfills. If we're building robots and planning trips to Mars, why not create a smart trash can that recognizes what's been thrown into it? The Binny team has done just that. Using AI, they've achieved impressive accuracy, misidentifying waste only 8% of the time. From plastic cans and aluminum bottles to batteries, it handles a wide range of trash. Everything is automatically sorted into different sections and, when possible, compressed. When the bin is full, it sends a notification to your smartphone or email. The data is also stored in the cloud, allowing garbage trucks to save fuel by planning their routes more efficiently. DHR Engineering. DHR Engineering specializes in automation. They've already collaborated with industry giants like BMW and SKF, the world's leading bearing manufacturer. One day, they faced the task of automating 3D printing, finding the current printer slow and challenging to maintain. Then they encountered the Bamboo Lab X1 Carbon at a client facility. This printer was so effective that it became the central component of the installation shown on the screen. The setup consists of two Bamboo Lab X1 carbon printers augmented by a robotic system designed by DHR Engineering. This configuration is not only five times cheaper to maintain, but also capable of printing large parts using more than 100 kilograms of material. Moreover, it operates three times faster than conventional standalone printers. StreamXO. The StreamXO exoskeleton was designed to assist railroad workers. Weighing only seven kilograms, it operates for about six hours on a single charge. But how well does StreamXO perform? Prototypes have been tested on actual railroad construction sites in Italy. Workers equipped with StreamXO carried 30 kilogram concrete blocks. The results were impressive. StreamXO cut the risk of overexertion and musculoskeletal injuries by 50% and also reduced muscle fatigue by 15 to 30%. Plus, its compact design doesn't hinder movement. It all sounds promising. Here's hoping big businesses take notice. Valella Project. In 2022, the average person on Earth consumed 20.5 kilograms of fish per year. 60 years ago, that number was less than 10 kilograms. In other words, fish demand is rising. Can producers keep up? Yes, if they embrace modern fish farming innovations. Let's look at the Valella Project, a development from Hawaii. It involves farming fish in large, durable aquapod spheres that are up to 28 meters in diameter and made of reinforced plastic and steel wire. These structures protect young fish from predators and help prevent diseases. Cobia is one of the fish thriving in aquapods. They're rich in omega-3 acids. In total, more than tens of thousands of specimens have been raised already. Well, thanks to Valella for all the fish.
Multiloader 3.0 BL. Meet the Multiloader 3.0 BL, a tracked carrier that's exceptional at hauling loads when larger equipment isn't an option and wheeled vehicles won't cut it. This carrier can confidently carry up to three tons of cargo. While it's not speedy at just 4.2 kilometers per hour, it's conveniently operated by remote control and automatically levels its load. This feature is particularly useful when working on slopes up to 20 degrees. The truck is compact, measuring 2.4 by 1.6 meters, which makes it handy in forests or tight warehouses. Plus, it's powered by two 5.3 kilowatt electric motors, making it eco-friendly.